I don't know. expect any headbutts or <laughs> preparation for that uh, Josh took all of those don't worry <laughs> well how did you find out you know you're being added to Texas um I had a meeting with um my manager over in Columbus Andy Tracy and uh you know he um you know gave me the good news kind of told me that you know I should be expecting to, uh, you know, be a part of this and um, just to kind of, you know, be able to get reps in, stay ready. And um, yeah, you know, just be a part of this and really soak up an experience. What would your brother say? Um, he was excited. I mean, uh, I feel like with Josh and everything, he's just um, like everything that I tell him, he's over the moon for it you know he's a really supportive brother and with everything that goes on he's always behind me 100 percent. and i mean it's really good to be able to be with him here and just be able to share this experience with him it's like sandy was kind of showing you the lay of the land just like what's what all are you trying to to soak in uh, I mean, you know, anything I can get. It's really good to be here with the guys. Um, a lot of familiar faces that I'd gotten to know a lot better in spring training and, you know, just more uh, that I'm trying to get to know more and more here. Um, you know, just be able to kind of um, shadow Hedgy and uh, Maley and just be able to kind of see how they do their things and kind of just know what, um, what to do and what to expect at this level and really just, you know, take everything I can to add to my game and really just, you know, be here for the team and do whatever I can do to help and just, you know, make this an amazing experience. Are you looking forward to sitting in with them as they, you know, break down the next series and, and you know, going over every batter that they, you know, as they prep for a series for you to be able to see how that process works. Is that something you're looking forward to? Oh, of course. I mean, those guys, they're, they're elite, um, you know, athletes in this game. And I mean, um, they've got special minds. So if being able to see that, you know, firsthand is, I mean, something that only a few people can ever be able to, you know, wish for. And I'm lucky enough to be able to have that experience. And, you know, uh, it's something that I look forward to. Well, what was the key to, you know, offensively to, to your performance this year? What, what happened, you know, uh, I mean, I think a big part of it was, um, you know, my my mental side, but also just a few um, mechanical adjustments um, that I that we had taken care of me and a few of the other guys over in uh, Arizona um, in the past offseason um, that really kind of helped get me through this whole season. Uh, I think that I had like after last season, I had a goal in mind, um, you know, to be as consistent as possible in my routine, my prep, and just my overall mentality going into the game. Um, and all that I feel like really came well together from start to finish um, to this point. And uh, I'm, I'm really happy with it. Where did you make the most strides this year in your estimation uh, in terms of defense? Was it uh, a <clears throat> game, throwing, blocking? Where, where did you work most? I think game calling for sure. I mean, I think that I really took um, a, a pr an approach to get to know my pitchers and the guys that I was working with in front of me um, very seriously and got to know them as best as possible um, to, you know, be able to see what kind of stuff that they like to use in certain counts, um, just kind of be able to see their stuff, how it goes throughout a long game and um, just be able to make in-game adjustments. I think that um, also me be, like working with um, the pitching coaches that I with, that I was with this year and just like keeping an open dialogue. I think that really helped um, my game calling and just overall my, um, you know, defensive experience this year. Was it, was it hard? You know, you see what 16 guys come up and make a big league debut. And you, you're kind of sitting there on, on the on deck circle. How was it hard being patient and waiting? Oh, no. I mean, uh, I'm, a, I'm a big believer in, you know, 
uh, everyone has their time. And I mean, uh, I feel like I really kept my head down and just worked in the stuff that I need to work on to polish my game, to make sure I'm doing whatever I need to do. And um, every opportunity that came to those guys, I was really happy for them. I mean, those guys are all like my brothers. And I feel like over the years, the relationship that we've built, um, you know, we share those moments and every new opportunity that was presented with, you know, all of those call-ups, I was over the moon ecstatic for them. And, you know, it just makes you more excited to have that kind of experience for yourself. So if anything, I think it just, you know, um, gave me something more forward to look to and just, you know, makes me want to make my game that much better. Thank you guys.